Hello, teachers, administrators, and district coordinators. My name is Mary McCarley, and I am the National Content Specialist with Goodhart Wilcox. In this presentation, I'll provide you a brief overview of child development, and we'll show you how to navigate the online platform. This comprehensive text explores the many stages of growth and development that children experience from the prenatal stage through the school age years. Written for high school students, child development effectively explains the study of children's physical, intellectual, social, and emotional development. Students will learn positive ways to care for children and meet their needs during these formative early years. Chapters open with colorful images to captivate student attention. Each chapter includes an essential question and case study, which helps students relate content to real world situations. Each lesson begins with key terms, academic terms, objectives, a reading and writing activity, and a graphic organizer. Brightly colored images engage young readers. To increase comprehension and decrease reader fatigue, our authors have been intentional about writing smaller, more focused paragraphs of information. GW authors are experts in their field and have significant classroom and industry experience. As a result, our texts provide strong pedagogy. Embedded within the pages of the book are special features to engage students in real life application and cross-curricular instruction. These features include Focus on science, which shows how content connects to poor subjects. Focus on careers highlights different child-related careers. Focus on social studies points out new important content about acquiring cultural specific knowledge. Notice how these features identifies a career cluster, education requirements, and job outlook. Additional special features include investigate special topics, which highlights the use of technology and includes an application activity that has students conduct their own research to further investigate each topic. Lastly, the focus on health feature provides helpful tips about important health related topics. Mental health and wellness is an important subject. Scattered throughout the text are mental health advisory features, which emphasize what contributes to mental health problems in various stages of development. At the end of each chapter, there is review and assessment section. Included in these chapter reviews are summaries, college and career portfolio activities, as well as a variety of questions that assess student learning related to vocabulary, critical thinking, core skills, and observation activities. Notice the activity icon next to the image. You'll see these icons throughout the print and digital textbook. By clicking on the icon, it will take students to the companion website to practice, assess, and reinforce learning. Links from the textbook direct students to activities, vocabulary games, e-flashcards, matching games, pre-tests, post-tests, and more. Extend and review learning with the student workbook, which is available in both print and digital formats and includes creative activities developed by educators. Teachers, you will also have access to our extensive instructor resources to help you plan and facilitate your course. All instructional material are found on a convenient online bookshelf and accessible at home, at school, or on the go. Support materials include detailed ready-made lesson plans, ready-to-use editable PowerPoint presentations, which are full of color and visually appealing graphics, graphic organizers, handouts. Teachers can also create customized chapter tests and unit exams using the ExamView software. Lastly, teachers will have access to the textbook, workbook, and instructor resources answer keys to make grading easier. These are the instructional resources for teachers and the online instructor resources. Teachers will have access to the student textbook, the companion website, student workbook, instructor's edition, and the online instructor resources. The student online platform will be very similar, but will not include the instructor's edition or the instructor resources. 
For those schools who choose to integrate with a learning management system, your online platform will appear differently than what you see on the screen, but the resources will be the same. Now, let's take a look at the online platform. This is the online platform for child development. I'll show you how to navigate the resources. First, let's start with the student textbook. The textbook is divided by units and by chapters. I'll click on chapter one, learning about children. On the left-hand side, you'll see a toolbar. The plus allows you to zoom in and see this page closer. Minus, zoom out. The third button down, or the contents button, allows you to go to another unit or chapter of the book. Click again to close. The fourth button down, or the resource tab, allows you to go directly to the companion website. The companion website will house the interactive tools from within the pages of the book. Click again to close. Lastly, both students and teachers can print pages of the textbook. This could be extremely helpful if you have a student with an IEP or 504 who needs to mark a hard copy of the text. There are arrows on the left and the right that allow you to go to the next page of the book. We are on page six, so page six of the digital text will be the same as page six of the hard copy of the text. You can go to another page of the book by typing in the page number here and clicking. You can also search our book by a key term and it will take you to all the pages of the book that include that key term and the key term will be highlighted as well. Lastly, throughout the pages of the book, you'll see this activity icon. By hovering over the activity icon, a blue rectangle or square will appear and clicking on the activity icon, students will be directed to the companion website. This was a brief overview of our student textbook. In the top left corner, I'm going to click the My Bookshelf tab to take me back to the main landing page. Next, the companion website. The companion website will house those interactive tools. Students can access it from the main landing page here or from within the pages of the textbook or the toolbar within the pages of the textbook. I'll click on it from the main landing page. You can see that the companion website is divided by units, chapters, and lessons. I strongly encourage you to check out these interactive tools. Next, let's look at the student workbook. The student workbook is also divided by units and by chapters. I'll click on chapter one again, learning about children. On the left-hand side, you'll see that familiar toolbar. This time, the fourth button down or the resource tab is going to take students to the workbook with form fields. Now students will be able to access a digital copy of the workbook pages so that they can type directly in and submit digitally. I'll click on lesson 1.2, a look at tomorrow. As you can see, I can now type directly into the form fields and submit digitally. Next, I'm gonna click the My Bookshelf tab to take me back, but now let's look at the resources available for teachers. Teachers, you also have access to the Instructor's Edition and the Online Instructor Resources. I'm going to click on the Online Instructor Resources. You'll see three gray tabs. First, Resource Material. Here you'll find Introduction, Rubrics, Best Practices, the correlation to the national standards for human development, more information on best practices and additional resources. I'll minimize this gray tab. Next, chapter resources. Teachers, this is where you'll go most often to help you plan and facilitate your course. Let's click on chapter one again, learning about children. There are textbook answer keys, workbook answer keys. Every lesson has a lesson plan a graphic organizer, and additional handouts to go with the lesson plan. Also, every chapter has a PowerPoint that is divided by lesson and you can edit it as well. By clicking on another chapter, you'll find that the format is the same. I'll minimize chapter resource tab. 
Lastly, assessment software and question pool. This is the software that is needed to create and customize exams for students. Now is the time to update your curriculum. We offer print resources, digital resources, and bundle for those districts who prefer print and digital resources for students. We integrate with learning management systems, offer rostering implementation options, and teachers can post to other platforms such as Google Classroom and Microsoft Teams. We offer easy, quick implementation, training, professional development, and ongoing support. If you do not already have access to our online platform, first, contact your GW Educational Consultant today. Second, schedule a 60-day free preview and try the resources in your own classroom. Third, choose GW, select implementation and training dates, and you are ready to get started. Let's work together to build careers.